Hey guys, Calvin from the Cartoon Company, New Zealand. I'm sitting on a uh, 1UZ VVTi Lexus motor, powered vehicle. Also happens to have a Link ECU in it. So this is going to work for both Link and for your VVTi. Got this little OBD2 dongle. Lots of different ones available. Um, so using one for your market or that you can get. If you're in America, Amazon, eBay, AliExpress, any of those. Over here we use Trade Me. So I use these ones and they work pretty well. And we're going to show you the setup and what to do it. I'm going to do it in real time. So it's that one there. This particular vehicle. It has the Link ECU and a factory ECU. And I'm going to communicate this time with the Link. In she goes. We're going to turn the truck on. I've got my phone. I'm going to go into my settings. Connections. You can't actually see it very well. We're going to go turn the Bluetooth, turn the Bluetooth on. Click into the Bluetooth and it's scanning. Carl's phone, we're not going for that one, we're going for the OBD2. It's asking me for a PIN number. One, two, three, four. Okay. And that is now paired. Next I'm going to go into my apps, and I'm going into the Talk app. Talk. I'm going to just confirm in the settings. OBD2 adapters and it's just building the list for me and the there it is there there's the OBD2 adapter it is already paired into this can you fire actually no don't fire it up because it'll make lots of uh, we won't be able to hear the, what I'm talking about I'm going into the real-time readings I'm just going to give it a moment this thing's flashing up here that it's connecting in and what I'm going to look for, throttle and coolant. So there we go. Coolant's at 66. Throttle is at uh, 6.3. So we've got some communications. As I said, this will work on both the VVTi ECU. This particular one doesn't work on three UZs. It's just different protocols, different little adapters. But it works with the link really well. And it's a, a great addition when you've got a aftermarket ECU, if it does bring up something funny or a stock VVTi, if it brings up some information or brings on a check light, you can check it, check some live data, clear fault codes, do some diagnostics. So really, really helpful and very easy to leave in a vehicle not having a laptop or a, or a scandal. So I hope that was helpful and we'll talk to you again. Catch you later.